this joke. So, what well, hey, still the question for you is, why was Six afraid of saving? Is what we wonder. Why was Six afraid of saving? That's a good question. And what did you say, sir? Seven, eight, nine. No, that would be kind of like the baby version of the joke. But since we're all about the age of four, and why was Six afraid of seven? Because this is saving. <laughs> It's, it's not so much like a friend is in socially uncomfortable around saving. <laughs> you go to the cafeteria, the only seat is with saving. It's maybe I'll eat at my desk today. <laughs> uh, so, hey, the other question is, there was uh, this lady named Mrs. Bigger, and she has a baby called Mrs. Bigger's baby. And what I wonder is, who's bigger? Mrs. Bigger or Mrs. Bigger's baby? Ooh, that's good. And you... <laughs> You belong at every comedy show. You are the, the inner voice. She's saying what we are thinking. <laughs> that will be useful all night long. Mrs. <laughs> uh, uh, Speaker or Mrs. Speaker's baby is actually quite simple. It's Mrs. Bigger. Uh, Mrs. Bigger is actually kind of morbidly obese. <laughs> Which made for Mrs. Bigger's baby a very difficult childhood. But, uh, Okay, that's that. Uh, <laughs> now, of course, uh, since the noob cannot talk because of when he watched this, we have a little whiteboard for you to help with the funny silly jokes. So, uh, hey, the noob, I have a silly question for you. So there's this fella with no arms and has no legs, and he's floating in the water. What is that fellow's name with no arms, no legs, floating in the water? <laughs> Dave. That's right, the noob is Dave. <laughs> It's actually kind of a sad story. There was this fella Dave, and he uh, had no arms or legs, and he could not swim in the water, so he drowned and he died. <laughs> you and you and Dave were pretty tight, weren't you? <laughs> okay, the noob. Uh, here's one. Hey, I wonder uh, what is the difference between an egg and a lion? Oh, you do not know the noob? Well, then remind me the noob not to send you to the store to buy me eggs. <laughs> because you might come back from the store with lions. And you know, if I say, put a dozen eggs on the list, who knows if you come home and then it's a dozen lions at the door, if you could even make it home with a dozen lions in the car. That would be terrible. I would say, oh, why did I send the noob? I wish that I had asked him earlier if he knew the difference between an egg and a lion. And now I have. And that whole scenario is a moot point because never shall I send you to the store, the noob, to fetch me eggs for fear of being assaulted by lions. <laughs> I stand corrected. The noob does know the difference between an egg and a lion, so. That was that joke. Okay, and hey, really quick, the noob. And there was this fellow Pete, and there was this other fellow Repeat. And they go to the cliff, and Pete tumbles off the cliff. And the question that I pose to you, the noob, is with Pete off the cliff, who is left at the top of the cliff? Who, this lady says. <laughs> and what, says the noob. <laughs> I apologize. Uh, the noob, I kind of sped through that. There was Pete, there was Repeat. They go to the top of the cliff. Now, Pete was less careless than Repeat, so Pete tumbles off the side of the cliff and he falls down. And the simple question that I want to know the noob is with Pete at the bottom of the cliff, who is left at the top of the cliff? Say again. Okay, there was Pete, there was Repeat, sons of kind of wealthy suburban folks. They get so bored with life, they move to drugs. So Pete is up at the top rolling a doobie in his mouth, and he says, oh my God, I can see all the planets. I can see all the stars. I can see everybody living together in perfect harmony. Plop off the cliff and he's dead now. So the police come. They say, you, you at the top of the cliff. You, boy, with the name Repeat, tattooed into your chest muscles. You, Repeat, Repeat, what is your name? For the official records, we can read it on your shirt, but we need to know for the police report. What is your name? Repeat. That's right, the noob, it was Repeat at the top of the cliff. Okay, 
thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to try a, a little bit of knock knock joke, and uh, the noob's going to handle this one, so I know it's so gut reflex. When somebody says knock knock to shout, who is there? But uh, that will only insult the noob because he wants to shout it so bad. So we will let him feel this one. Hey, the noob, knock knock, my buddy. Why, who is there? Why? It is Boo. Boo is at the door. A fellow by the name of Boo is at the door waiting to come into the house. Boo Boo. Why? Why are you crying, the noob? Well, he's crying because we are all alone in this world. Uh, there is no happiness, the only constant is never-ending despair. <laughs> okay. Okay. 